Welcome back. We are here with Michael McDowell, winner of the Daytona 500. You're originally from Arizona, and you've been, I was telling Ryan this, you're one, what we like to call a lifer. You've been with your wife since you were 15 <laughs> years old. Yeah, it's, it's incredible. We've been on this journey together, you know, and, and that's what makes it so sweet, you know, starting out in my career and, and racing go-karts and then, you know, moving up the ladder. She's been with me the whole time. And, and so to, to celebrate this moment with her and, and with my kids, it's, it makes it so special. Does she always get nervous when you're racing? I think that she's always a little bit nervous, but, but Daytona in particular, just because of the style of racing that NASCAR has at these super speedways, there's typically a big fiery crash like you saw. And so those ones make her extra nervous. And, and the race ended nine, nine, hours, nine after hours after it began. How do people, how do the fans last that long? I don't know, but we have the most incredible fans ever in NASCAR. I mean, it was a downpour in Daytona Beach, and when when I came back to the race car, they were all still there. So I, I'm not sure what they did while they're in Daytona, but they were in their seats ready to go when we went back racing. We had the most incredible fans. It's it's amazing their dedication to our sport. Um, you know, NASCAR is unbelievable. I can't believe that I'm one of 40 drivers that gets to do this every weekend and, and to have great fans like we do, it, it makes it all worthwhile. Well, congratulations once again. A pleasure meeting you and keep it up. Good luck. Thank you, guys. The next one. Yeah. This weekend, the race Sunday at 3 p.m. That's on Fox. We'll be right back here on Live.